Actually, no, I don't want to go anymore. Oh, okay. Just kidding, see you in 10 minutes. Okay. Just kidding, we're not going. <laughs> what have you done? I found an animal. Yes. It doesn't work for everybody. No. Oh. What's, what's the point? Hey, it's a cool sweater. I like it. Listen, I don't need your passive aggressive attitude. I'm being serious. I like your sweater. What? The design is really cool. Actually? Yeah. Really? Really. Why are you being so weird about it? I'm not. I'm just. I just really appreciate. Because usually saying that. you dress like a single 75-year-old boomer who lives alone with her 12 cats, who exclusively shops at Macy's or Walmart. The prices are very reasonable. Or an organic, gluten-free thrift store that doubles as a matcha cafe. What does that even mean? And also, is that a real place? So you think you're all cool now because you have a nice sweater? No, I just. Because you're I... not. You're still weird as f and you look like the bottom of a lumberjack's foot. And you know what else? I have to say that I you are. Well, who cuts people's hair in the middle of the night? I do. They call me the Midnight Barber. Yeah, well, that's an infringement of people's liberties. Is it? Yeah, so don't ever be doing that to me. I do do it to you. What? Who do you think cuts your hair, Einstein? My hair just doesn't grow very fast. What, you think it stays that length naturally? I'm in there in the night, styling away. How dare you do that to me in the night, when I'm oblivious? I do my best work when you're oblivious. I'll lean you up against the pillow, and I'll go at you. That's perverse. Hello. What's up? I've got really cool glass. Thank you. They're pit vipers. I really want, I just want everything that's in your ring right now. Yeah, I got this really cool insane. thing that I have. Hi. <gasps> oh my god. Yeah, that's it's so me. Cool. It. I'm the real Kermit. You can have me. She's holding me hostage here. What? I got a lot of. <laughs> she just skipped me so fast. God, that's like being on Tinder and they just swipe left or right, whatever the bad one is. Right in front of your face. God damn. Oh, my ego. It's fine. I'm fine. Oh, what's happening to you? She's hot. <laughs> oh, your shit is funny. I won't even lie to you. Okay. Well, hey, I appreciate that, man. I'll play you a song really quick. That's it. No, that's great. That's amazing. <laughs> Get out of time. I want one. Something I want to say before. Oh, let's do it. All right, go. <laughs> Oops, got your coping skills. Now let's see what we got. That's not a coping skill. Lloyd? That's right. It's me, your son. And it's Lloyd, Dad. No. L L O Y D. I named you. You ruined my life! How could I ruin your life? I wasn't even there! Oh, isn't it sweet how our kids are playing together? Yeah, it's adorable. They're probably playing house together or something. Oh, yeah, probably. Your father and I have called this family meeting to tell you. You tell them. Emma's <sighs> getting a divorce! What? No! I'm sorry, honey, but we've already decided. You must choose. Choose what? Who to live with full time. Or who to visit on the weekends. But what about Christmas? See? Look what you're doing to this family! Well, I wasn't the one to sleep with Stacy from HR! And after our son Mario disappeared! Emma made a mistake! This marriage was a mistake! Mama! Papa! It's a me! Mario! Does this mean we could double the presents? Ah! Hi! Come to this place often? Sometimes. <laughs> what are you doing there? Just trimming my bush. Just... I like to keep it tidy. <laughs> this is my bathroom. Just in here. It's, uh, it's... What the f What are you doing? Mind your damn why business. Why are you sitting on it backwards? Mind your damn business! I don't even know. You shouldn't like you leave. Okay, I'm moving out. Hey. Hey. Is your name Jean? Because you're wearing them. I am. Did you use your echolocation to find me? Or the smell of my musk? It was smell. <laughs> <laughs>
Who are you? Don't mind me, I'm just a whisper in the wind. Okay. You want me to put you? I'd love that. Cause your beauty's been pushing me over the edge. I, I, you're strong, damn. Yeah, I like when you slam back. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes. These woods? It's playground. I like how it smells here. <laughs> you should slide down this slide like you slid into my DMs. Watch me. Oh, uh, slower. Uh. Like that? Skip a step. We need to lube it up. Come sit with me. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That fits good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, I got us a haircut. So, what do we think? I would have personally liked to be consulted first. I wasn't mentally prepared to look like an off brand Justin Bieber just yet. Okay. I approve of this cut. Oh, good, you like it. Ah, it's very practical for combat situations, less to grab onto. It's not why I got it, but less grabability could be a negative too, if you know what I mean. And for those reasons, I'm out. This isn't Shark Tank. You can't just- No! Where's the flow, bro? I'm sorry. I just- <laughs> I don't even know who I am anymore. Chad. Chad's dead. And you killed him. I think it's kind of hot. Yeah, it's kind of growing on me too. <laughs> well, I think we look chic. Oh, we could be in one of those Vogue magazines or something. Oh, yeah, but you still dress like Adam Sandler. So maybe like People magazine or something. How dare you? I just can't believe the betrayal. Like, how dare she cut her own head of hair? Like... <sighs> well, I think it makes us look... Permission to swear? Granted. Badass. Super badass. Awesome! And Riley, what do you think? Do you like it? Yeah, I do. If it's okay with you, it's okay with me. So, we starting the boy band or what? Okay, ready, Colby? Yeah. Okay. What's up, guys? It's Sam and Colby. And we're here to- Dude, that cat ball went off! What? Oh! What? 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 If there's a spirit here, make a sound. <gasps> Dude, did you hear that? Did you hear that? What was that? I farted. We've been told this is like the spookiest, most haunted place in the house. So, I'm check it out. Don't close the door, Colby. I won't. Don't, dude, dude, dude. Door. I'm not going to. <laughs> We're halfway through the video and... Buy the merch! Buy the merch! Buy the like merch. the video, buy the merch. Subscribe, uh, subscribe, subscribe. Thumbs up, thumbs up. Okay, pose. That's hot. That's hot. <sighs> we got Colby here doing the Estes method. Is there any spirits here that want to talk to me? Yes. What do you want to say? You're a little bitch. <laughs> oh, me when you're me me when me when I me, me when you're when I when I when your mom sees me when I see your mom me when me when your mom comes to my shit shit shit. What are you gonna order? Uh, I don't know. Why do you ask? Oh, because I'm going to base what I order off of what you order, because I don't want to seem like I eat more than you do or eat worse than you do. So. I really want to chop my hair. What do you think? Why are you asking me? Oh, because I won't do it until you confirm with me that you will still find me attractive after I do it. Ugh, I haven't eaten anything all day. <laughs> I haven't eaten since yesterday. You guys want a f***ing award? Shut the f*** up. Hey, babe. Yeah. I am testing you right now, and your answer will set the tone in my mood for the rest of this evening, all right? Does this make me look fat? Hey, can I buy you a drink? I'd like that, but I'm not initially attracted to you, so if you did, I'd feel obligated to hang out with you, and I really don't feel like doing that right now. I'd rather dance by myself and be looked at, but not touched, so I'm gonna have to pass. Wait, wait, wait. Actually, that's a really good idea, Kelly. What did I say? I talk a lot, so I've learned to just tune myself out. 
I know I don't usually talk to you guys like this, and most of you probably don't want to see this, but this is for anybody else who needs to hear this. I have been seeing so many women on this app with their life together. They get up, they drink water, they have green juice and egg whites and oatmeal, and they exercise a lot. Bless them. I'm on my third cup of coffee. It's 10 a.m. I'm wearing half the makeup on my faces from yesterday. And I haven't worked out. We don't need to talk about it. But I just want to say. It's okay that you don't have your life together. Because I don't. And I'm not going to change. Because I don't really care. I'm probably going to have a piece of toast with peanut butter and jam. Right now. So I'm one of those people that just like to like learn things randomly. Um, like I'm relearning guitar and I'm learning ASL right now because I think that that's important um, and really interesting. So uh, here's like a little a little tidbit of what I've learned so far. All right, here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh, I just had the most intrusive thought. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I get those all the time. What was yours? <laughs> I just imagine trying to shove this entire muffin into my mouth at once. <laughs> oh, that's that's not really an, an intrusive thought. That's more of an impulsive thought. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, no. An intrusive thought would be, I want to shove your muffin down your throat like it's a tube sock and a vacuum pipe. <laughs> Hypothetically. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So intrusive would be, I want to pick up this muffin and throw it at the wall as hard as I can. <laughs> it's close. It's close. Intrusive would be more like, I want to throw this stale rock hard muffin at an innocent bystander walking on the street, preferably a child holding a balloon to see it topple over like a bowling pin while it watches the only thing that brought it joy that day float away into the abyss, <laughs> you know, <laughs> hypothetically. Do you or do you not feel bonita? I feel bonita. Wonderful, because you look bonita. Okay, all packed up, ready to go. Did you put Jessica in the car seat okay? Yeah. Are you sure? Yes. Positive. A positive. Maybe I should sit back there with her. I just... No. All right, all packed up, ready to go. Yep. Yeah, oh, I feel like I'm forgetting something, though. Oh, we got the floaties, towels, beer. I think we're good. Yeah, it's probably nothing. Let's go. Christina's not in the car. What? Oh, shit. You're the oldest. She's your responsibility. This is on you. All right, all packed up, ready to go. Let's hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back. Let's do it. All right, here we go. <gasps> oh my God, what was that? That was Jacob. What? You're okay. Walk it off. He doesn't walk yet, Kara. Still? You left him on top of the car. Hey, this is on you. I am really sick right now and don't have the capacity to move, so I thought I would do a little tap-tap story time. Here we go. Our story begins in... Yemen. Where our main characters, Jessica and Alyssa, those are my sister's names, are... Ugly. <laughs> Since they are ugly, they need to find a yellow, crimson, titanium... Gemstones spelt with a J that'll make them pretty. As they begin their journey on the path, they run into a werewolf. What? The werewolf grabs Alyssa by the cankles, and Jessica yells, Jesus Christ with a G. Seeing that Alyssa was probably going to die, she yelled, I'm out this bitch, yo. Alyssa could not believe her sister's betrayal, so she yelled at her, I. Slept with your husband. It's so nice to finally get out and go to dinner without the kids. Ah, agreed. Hello, welcome. How may I help you and your friend? Uh, girlfriend. <laughs> uh, do you have a reservation? No, I've never needed one here before. No. Well, we are completely full, so we cannot serve you. Then why do I see four empty tables right there? Those are reserved. For who? Other people. Oh, I do not see any other people here. <laughs> They're running late, I guess. All of them? Yes. Let me ask you this, Todd. 
Do you like your fingers? Oh, no. I don't understand the question. Let me rephrase. Do you like your fingers being attached to the rest of your body? Are you implying that you would take off my fingers? Oh, I did not say that. Did I say that, Janet? She didn't say that. You said that. Uh, but now we have that all sorted. You can sit this in one of those four tables that we both know nobody is coming to sit in tonight. And you can keep your pretty little fingers so you can go home to your extremely unsatisfied wife and actually put them to use for once. Deal? Right this way. <laughs> you weren't actually going to take his fingers, right? Of course not. <laughs> okay. Get on your knees, baby girl. Mommy John knows daddy's getting high. <laughs> At the body shop, <laughs> doing something on your heart. Whatever daddy wants, daddy gets. Hello, my little ravioli, my tortellini. Oh, hey, Ma. Hey, oh, Nona. It's almost noon, and you're still in your sweatpants. Riley, can you tell your Nona it's a Sunday and we're having a movie day? Uh, Mom told me to tell you that it's Sunday. Can you tell your mother that I just watched an eight-part series on Netflix about how screens rot your brain? Nona told me to tell you she watched an eight-part You want to tell your Nona to repeat the sentence she just said and realize how backwards idiotic that just sounded? Mom told me to tell- Tell your mother we forced her to go outside, rain or shine, until the sun went down and look how she turned out. Nona said- You want to tell your Nona I got bullied every day by the neighbor kids because she stuck me outside and that's probably why I have trust issues and social anxiety and need to go to therapy on a daily basis? Tell your mother back in my day we didn't go to therapy. We did the healthy thing with our feelings, the three B's. Beat down, bury, and bottle. That, that doesn't seem healthy. Can you ask your Nona why she's even here? Tell her I'm here because I wanted to ask if you guys want to go to the movies with me. I, you tell your Nona. I... Well, that was rude. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to school. Why don't we reintroduce ourselves and tell a little fun fact about the winter break? Oh, this is like our mother's meetings. Your mom's meetings? I no, the ones where she talks about her issues. Oh, um, uh, therapy? Oh, my mom takes me to those. We all sit in a circle like this, too. Oh, yeah, I think my daddy used to go to those, too. Oh, not anymore. Nope. He's in jail now. I feel like those Canadians always run those meetings, too, because they always call it AA. AA? Oh, no, no, that's not what we're doing. Um, Riley, why don't you just start it off? <laughs> Hi, I'm Riley. Hi, Hi Riley. Riley. And last week, I took a sip of my mom's spicy juice and then took three dollars out of her purse to buy candy from Tony. H who's Tony? Hi, I'm Buddy. Hi, Hi buddy. buddy. And I put a metal fork in the microwave yesterday to see if it would explode. Did it? Yep. Okay, this isn't what this is supposed to be, so I think we're just gonna stop. What's up? Okay. My name's Tony. Hi, Hi Tony. Tony. All right, let's get to the brass tacks. I got gushers going for a dollar a piece. I got a two-for-one deal going for fruit by the foot. And for any of you heavy hitters, I got warheads going for three dollars a piece. And they're hard to come by, so there's no negotiating that. Are you even in this class? Don't get your panties in a twist, toots, okay? I'm in Miss Reznikoff's first grade class. I'm just trying to do business. Can I have a pack of gushers and a warhead? You got it. No, no, no. It's nice having everybody together. Yeah. Ba. Yeah. Ba. Ba. Yeah, whatever. What? Yeah. Oh, let me take a photo of everybody. Oh, yeah, good idea. Here's my phone, Mom. Okay. Okay, scooch in, everyone. Okay. <laughs> Smile. Why is it facing me? You just have to turn it around, Ma. Like that? No. Me, it's the camera. Like that? It's the little button on the screen with the arrows. Oh, I see it. 
Oh, look at that. Okay, get together. Smile. How do you take the photo? Oh my. It's the white one. The war is won? No, Dad, we're taking a photograph. They're infiltrating with brass? No. Hey, cover! Ma, it's just the button right there. Oh, okay. Got it. Okay. Here we go. Everybody smile. Oh, it disappeared on me. Where'd it go? <sighs> okay, calm your corned beef curtains. I fixed it, okay? Get together. Smile. Should I put the flash on? Just take the photo! Guess what, guys? I got my first tattoo. Oh, no way. Cool! Oh, this should be good. <laughs> oh, let's see. Va. Sure. No, yeah. wait, wait, let me guess, let me guess. What is the most basic white boy tattoo? Uh, a lion with a crown. No, no. A Roman numeral clock with an anchor in front of it. <laughs> yeah. No? <laughs> no, 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 it's probably like barbed wire. <laughs> Trees growing up his arm. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Tall trees. Oh, yeah, ooh, ooh. Or an infinity sign. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> it's probably like a compass inside a rose. Ah, with a snake around it. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Laugh it up, all right? Because I tripped you. Okay, I haven't got a tattoo yet, but I'm going to get a tattoo. And I knew you guys would make fun of me for it, so now I know what not to get. So suck it. Jeez, what's his problem? Oh. <laughs>